It's been around one year since Korea introduced a law to crack down on graft and corruption among people working in several key sectors. The main way of doing that was by limiting the price of gifts that people can accept. It means the days of giving certain people lavish gifts are no more. However, if you're on a tighter budget, the new rules are probably music to your ears. Lee jong Yun reports. Fruits packed in boxes, canned ham gift sets, cooking oil, and Korean red ginseng. They're all out on display for Chuseok, Korea's Thanksgiving holiday. But what's different about this year's holiday is that it also marks one year since the Improper Solicitation and Graft Act, better known as the Kim Young-lan Act, was implemented. Aimed at preventing bribery, the act limits the amount of money that can be spent on gifts for civil servants, those working in the media and in education. It generally follows the 3-5-10 rule, which states only 30,000 won or about 26 U.S. dollars can be spent when treating someone to a meal, 50,000 won or 45 dollars can be spent on gifts, and 100,000 won or roughly 88 dollars given as a monetary gift for occasions such as weddings or funerals. This year, many gift sets, such as this box of mixed nuts, are priced at just under 50,000 won for consumers to have more options while still abiding by the Kim Young-lan Act. A lot of people are looking for gifts costing less than $30. Chuseok's just around the corner, so we're also offering products that don't go over 50,000 won or $45. According to data analyzed by the Ministry of Agriculture, while sales of gifts priced between 30 and 50,000 won have increased this year compared to last year, gifts ranging from 50,000 to 100,000 won fell drastically by 33 percent on year. The gift term mentioned the most online for this year's holiday was baked goods, while gifts that had been staples for special occasions, such as Korean red ginseng or Korean beef, decreased in the frequency they were mentioned. I know the Kim Young Lan Act doesn't apply to gifts between family members, so I'm not too worried about the price. I'm looking to spend between 50,000 to 100,000 won. I'm looking at a gift that is affordable but doesn't look cheap, like ham or cooking oil sets. I'll spend within the 50,000 won range. The general trend for goods over the last couple of years has been cost effectiveness. But now, with the Kim Young Lan Act in place, this practice of buying reasonably priced goods seems to be more common. Lee Jong Yun, Arirang News.